For many decades, humans have noted the strange dances of the bees, but no one had ever looked at them behind the reason of their dancing, before Carl von Frisch. No one ever thought to ask why they moved this way and that way, in a succession of figure eights. Von Frisch studied every tiny bee gesture and became fascinated by a mystery. He would set out a dish of sugar water for a bee from his experimental hive. The bee would feast upon it before flying back home. The marked bee would later return to dine on the delicious sugar water. Von Frisch noted that in just a few hours, a multitude of other bees would join her there. They were always her fellow hive mates, but here was the really amazing thing. Von Frisch observed that the other bees had not followed the marked bee to the feeding place. He had been careful to use sugar water, not honey, so that the bee's sense of smell could not guide them to the reward. He continued to move the dish of sugar water farther away, until it was several kilometers from the hive. Still, the hive mates would find their way to it. So how did the painted bee reveal the exact location of the sugar water, with such precision, that her hive mates could easily find their way to there? There was a secret message in their choreography. What had seemed to countless generations of observers to be nothing more than the meaningless spasmodic motions of a dumb animal was actually a complex message, an equation informed by mathematics, astronomy, and an acute knowledge of time, all synthesized to convey the location of the food she hoped to share with her sisters. Bees have a ability to see ultraviolet and polarized light, which allows them to determine the location of sun. Their eyes sense ultraviolet light, which can easily penetrate thick clouds. When light from the sun passes through the atmosphere, it gets polarized in a direction towards the sun. Bees' eyes can detect this orientation and determine the position of the sun even while looking in the opposite direction. This gives the bees a type of solar compass allowing them to always know the precise position of the sun in the sky. In addition to this bees possess a finely tuned internal clock. This clock is accurate enough for the bees to constantly estimate the new position of the sun. Even after spending many hours within the dark hut, they can even take into account changes in seasons or latitudes. The dancer used the angle of our star, the sun, to indicate the general direction of the food's location. Von Frisch noted that they use gravity as reference, when a bee danced straight upward, she meant fly toward the sun, and when she moved downward, she meant fly away from it, her movement left and right, conveyed the food's exact coordinates in space, sometimes kilometers away. The duration of her dance, down to a fraction of a second, indicated the length of time it would take her fellow bees to get there. She even factored in wind speed to more finely calibrate the message she danced. And this was true at any time of the year and from hive to hive, from continent to continent. Bees can do the math. Subscribe now and press the bell icon. Never miss an update.